All right, you guys, nerd out time. So I just finished modding out my Nerf gun. <laughs> it sounds really nerdy to say I've modded my Nerf gun, but we were watching these videos at work the other day, and apparently you can take this apart and remove what's called like an air restrictor, which is something that Nerf puts in there to limit the amount of air that pushes it out. Basically, you can drill that out and then like stretch the spring out, and it'll like increase the speed at which your darts can come flying out. So, I just completed doing that, and now I'm gonna test it out. You guys ready? Excellent. I can't wait to bring this back to work and have another Nerf battle at work. I'm gonna dominate. It's my little dart retriever. Oh dear God. Zip up your it's like jacket. It this will all Bobby be gone o. later today. Zip up your jacket, Bobby. Ah, I shot myself. You want to do it? Yeah. Okay, sit my lap. Ready? So then you grab right here, and you point, and go, boom! Whoa! Go get it. Uh, I love that she likes it so much. <laughs> Good morning, guys. How you doing? Early morning dart session. Happy Saturday. All right, take a seat. All right, grab it. Yeah. Remember, you put your hand in there and then squeeze. Wow! And go. <laughs> oh, oh it, it's supposed to be on the window, Dad. I missed. I'm sorry. I wonder how long we can do this before she gets bored. I know, right? Let me cock it. Finger on there. Ready? Please. Whoa! And... Please. Whoa! Okay, go get them. Can you get that one? That's high. Baby chick, there's one more. Reach up top. Reach up top, baby chick. Look up. Where's the sky? Where's the sky? Down the door. Look on the door. Now look up. Look up to the sky. Up, Dad. But where do airplanes fly? <laughs> oh, she looked straight at it. Up. Up. Look up. Look up. <laughs> no, not on your tippy toes. Look up. <laughs> on my toes? What? Where'd they go? Look, here, baby girl, look. They're right there. Look up, right up. There they are! You see them? Can you get them? Yeah. Yeah, nice job. Good job! More? Yeah. You guys, we've been doing this for like 15 minutes. Right. I'm shocked that she's still engaged with this. Oh my goodness, good job, baby. Put it in? She got the dart in all by herself. Uh-oh, you can't reach that one? Yeah. Here, please, please. There you go. Can you fit that one in the hole? Yeah. yeah? Nice work, kid. You guys, I'm thoroughly impressed. She took the gun from me and she's like, okay, I do it. And she went and got the darts and she actually put them all in the correct places. So the rain's already starting to come down. We got some ugly gray clouds going on. So I've got to mow the lawn before it gets soaking wet and also before it gets too long because uh, I think I showed you guys this earlier, but I use this mower, which is a manual mower. So when you push it, it spins. So when you push it, it spins. Uh, and if the grass gets too long, it just gets bogged up. So the reason I got this is because our yard is tiny. Like here, check out the size of our yard. There it is. That's our entire yard. We don't have a backyard, so it's just this. So it didn't make sense to buy a really big, you know, gas powered mower because it literally takes five minutes to mow this lawn and it would be a waste of money to spend three times as much on a gas mower. And then I'd have to buy gas. I'd have to keep it updated, keep it maintained. I've had that lawn mower for two and a half years. I've done nothing to it and this worked great. So anyways, gonna mow the lawn real quick before it starts pouring down rain.
and time. Four minutes and 50 seconds. I don't have time to edge the yard because it is now starting to rain, but at least I got it mowed before the rain started coming down. Anyways, now I actually have to get showered and ready for the day. All right, you guys, so we're back at Target, and this time I'm here because uh, we thought that Target had a home and garden section, and uh, like uh, Ash said yesterday, we're looking to get Baby Chick like a little playground for outside with like a little swing, maybe a slide, but uh, I don't see anything here. But while we were here, I'm getting some B-roll footage for the uh, do's and don'ts uh, for the one to six month uh, video that Ash is doing for all of you uh, expecting moms or current moms out there. Kind of just going over the stuff that we thought was really helpful that we thought you guys might wanna know. So I'm getting some footage of the different uh, items that we're gonna recommend or not recommend while we're here. Uh, hopefully we're gonna be able to film that this weekend and maybe even let it go live this week. No guarantees, but that's what we're gonna try and do. Excuse me, miss, your child is being a nuisance. What'd you find? We found a lot of Elma and some Buzz, and her favorite toys were Ben the Cars. Oh, did you find a lion? Who is that? Is that Simba? Can you say, Simba? The king has returned. No? The Lion King is one of the few Disney movies that we don't own, so uh, Baby Chick has never seen it. We need to get on that. Because if we're going to call ourselves true Disney fanatics, we need to get that Lion King. Now this is the aisle you should be in. All right, now she's in the right mindset. We're going down the right aisle. Family Guy? Is that Stewie? I think you have a few years till you get to watch Family Guy. A lot of years. That's better, look at that. Is that Elmo and Cookie Monster? You say Elmo. Elmo. Yeah. Elmo. Oh, and Batman? Oh my goodness, we're just finding all sorts of good stuff. She's already into video games. That's what I'm talking about. Aren't you excited about that, Mom? Real. We could have family video game nights. Yeah, I'm sorry I completely blanked on who it was. Uh, I think it was uh... But somebody commented and said that you probably shouldn't get something like a Batman or you know something that you guys like for a timeout mat because then she'll associate that with negativity. So that was a really good point. I don't know why we didn't think of that, but thank you guys for that. So we're back here, we're probably just gonna get like a plain mat or something like that to have her sit on. Um, or maybe we'll get something we don't like, like Hello Kitty, and we'll have her sit on that. <laughs> The funny thing is, is that she's happier sitting in it like this. Of course she is because it's different. Is that fun riding in there? It's like being off-roading. Do, like, do you like this store? Yeah. It's funny, this store, we're at Michael's, is like the equivalent of Best Buy for me with Ashley because she could just wander around here forever looking at everything. And believe me, she has. But it's fun. That's what she likes to do. Just like. I could look at electronics forever, it's my hobby, so it's kind of cool. Um, so she's wandering around looking for her sprays and whatnots and things to make more of her crafty creations for you guys. Are you driving the car? Yeah. Where are we going, crazy lady? All right, we're at the fourth store. We're now at Home Depot after going to Michael's, Target, Walmart, and then Home Depot. And we have yet to find any play structures of any sort, so hopefully they'll have something here. Like, sit. Sit, Daddy. You want me to sit? Sit, please. Yeah. <sighs> Ta -da! All right, so apparently they don't have anything here either, but Mommy found her swing. So apparently there's like a play structure place uh, in the Portland area that like specializes in playgrounds. So either we might have to do that or do the whole Craigslist thing and search for Craigslist. I'm thinking that might be our best bet. But mommy wants this swing in the backyard. The bare necessities of life will come to you. They'll come to you. Look for the bare necessities. The simple bare necessities. Careful. Forget about your worries and your stress. Oh. Hi. Hey. You vlogging? Yeah. Pointed at dad. Yeah. Can you point at dad? Look. Hello. Hello. <laughs> yeah, is that a bear? Say baloo. 
Say baloo. Baby girl, can you say baloo? Hey, Mowgli. How about you flicking that old mean fly off of your Papa Bear's nose? Papa oh. Bear? Hello, guys. He's growing out Let my armpit. <laughs> nuzzle your bosom. Um, That's awkward to hear you say it. Uh, so we are shooting the uh, tips, do's, and don'ts for uh, you upcoming or current parents video that we talked about a little while ago. So I, mummies. Mummies and, and daddies. Mummies and daddies. Um, so we're just kind of going through things that we, we found helpful and didn't find helpful. Uh, so we're shooting that right now, and then hopefully we'll have that up in the next week or so. And we're going to do it like as a series, so we're going to do like a 1 to 6 month, a 6 to 12 month, like a 12 to 8 month, 12 to 18 month, and then I think she might even do like a breastfeeding one or something like that. So, you said oh, <laughs> <laughs> So anyways, look for that upcoming, but uh, I'm just going to go ahead and end the vlog now because we've got a lot of shooting to do, and then we'll probably end up going to bed as usual. But uh, thanks so much for watching today. If you guys liked it, give it a thumbs up. And I will, I know I talked about at Target the other day that I was waxing my chest. We didn't get around to it that night, but it's going to be in tomorrow's vlog. We're going to be doing it tomorrow. I'm super excited. <laughs> yeah. So anyways, look for that tomorrow. Uh, we'll see you guys then. Uh, and until then, have a good day, night, afternoon. Bye. <laughs> I'm trying to teach her Twitter and I have to make it into Facebook terms. So it's like, okay, star is like, favorite is re or retweet is share, and follow is friend. So I'm having to like, be like try and translate Twitter into Facebook terms.